From my experience training a lot of real estate agents, I realize that many of us don't really know what our CRM can do for us. So I wanted to take a few minutes today just to talk about what all of the things are that your CRM can do for you. And I think you're going to be surprised when you realize that it can really be here to help you close more sales. So if you're going to be out marketing, you got to have a CRM and let's figure out exactly how to use it in order to make it more productive for you and also to help you to be hands free as much as possible, but also make it look like you really meant to do the work. So let's take a few minutes now and let's go through all the things that your CRM should and could be doing for you. I'm going to spend a bit of time right now really focusing on this thing called the CRM, right? And so for those of you who don't know, I know some of you have told me you don't use one. You've been putting things in Excel. You're still trying to find one. So let's really sit down and have a chat about what you're using now. Is it working for you? And the things that your CRM can and possibly do for you as opposed to just being a holding bin. Okay, so let's talk about that. First of all, CRM stands for Customer Relationship Management Software. Basically, it's a tool that can manage all of your business relationships and all the data having to do with including your deals and transactions if you wanted to do that, right? So business relationship, meaning communication and all of that, okay? So let's talk about various things that this can do for you. One, it's going to house and manage all your people, right? Obviously, we're going to put our people in there. We're going to keep track of old leads, new leads, close clients, even vendors or other agents. Doesn't matter. Put anybody in you want. And I don't believe that you need to have 10 different CRMs to do this, by the way. You should have one. And the reason is, is if you set it up and you put in the right things to track the kind of people you have in here, it's really easy to go into your dashboard or your account, run a search, save it. And for these different types of groups of people, right? And that's the, that's the key. So when you come in, you're clicking one button instead of having to come in and go, oh my God, who is this person, right? If you haven't set it up so you know who these people are, you're not going to be able to easily identify this, right? The other thing it can do is automate a drip campaign that keeps you top of mind. But basically, a drip campaign is just a set of um, tasks that can be automated and drip out, right? Basically, drip out to you. It can be, it could be emails, text to your people, emails, text to you if you set it up right. But it can do all of those things, okay? Provides you reminders of tasks you don't want to forget, such as appointments and calls and contract deadlines coming up. Gives you the ability to manage and track all your steps of the sale and, and your transaction if your system has that. Provides you opportunities to remember or automatically send special day and holiday communication. You could automate all of that, or you can blast it out on those days, maybe, right? Allows you to create and send digital or printed newsletters. Do you have newsletters in your system? That would be great if you did. Gives you a powerful email template building with a built-in library of online images. Does your CRM have a built-in library of online images? So you don't have to go to somewhere else to get them. You can just slap them into an email if you want. Um, real easy. Video emailing tools. Some of our CRMs have that. Mine does. Email, emailing tools built right in instead of requiring a third-party software to send them, right? If you have a huge database and you want to call quickly, your CRM could also bulk dial if you want to. I'm not a big fan personally of bulk dialing. I think it's really obvious when bulk dialing systems you know, come in. I've got to the point where if there's that delay, I just hang up on them and block them immediately. So I'm not a fan, but if you are into it, you find a system that hasn't. Ability to customize your dashboard, which is really great because when you come in, then you can immediately see all the things that are important to you. You can add your tags and your flags and your custom fields, sources so you know where your business is coming from, all of your settings to help you easily create that system that works best for your business. You want this to be set up correctly. You want to be able to set up advanced search options to be able to quickly find a specific contact in a group, which I talked about earlier. And if you can save that somewhere on your dashboard, when you come in, you can easily at a glance, FYI, I know how many people were in this webinar this morning, right before I started, I just opened up my CRM and there was a widget right on my home screen that said these many people signed up for this and I clicked on it and it created a complete list for me. So you can do that too if you've got a CRM that can manage that for you. Ability to view who's opening or clicking. Now this is absolutely imperative, although 
with the new iOS updates with Apple. It's a little different than it used to be. And this information provides you hot buying signs. So it's really, really important. You have the ability to see this kind of thing in your CRM. So you, hopefully you can. Access to view an integrated website property search. So maybe you've got a site like KB Core or Boomtown or sites that actually will send the information in of the searching and whatever the activity is that your website subscribers are doing. That's really hot. If you don't have that, you should be able to get into the back end of that website and see what's going on. And you need to be doing both. You're checking your CRM and you're also checking that if you don't have them connected. But um, hopefully you have a site that you can get, get into the back end and see the activity that the people are doing for, with you. Integration tools that help you automate incoming leads. So when you get a new lead off any signup form anywhere out there, whether it's your site or you're doing landing pages, whatever, you have a way to automatically get those into your system automatically to start a campaign hands-free. You know, I get leads at all hours of the night. In fact, I, all you guys were coming in. Many of you were coming in the middle of the night because I live in Arizona right now or Pacific time. I always know at about three in the morning, my phone starts to buzz for leads, not just for you, but my own real estate leads are coming in too. So, you know, it's coming in at all hours. You want to communicate with them as fast as you can. And who's going to get up and do that in the middle of the night, right? Um, AI, automated intelligence, that can start and respond to, to a conversation by itself via, via built-in smart software. I'm really excited because I'm starting to look into some of that for myself and my uh, business to help other people with. So it's really cool if it's done right. That's the problem <laughs> because uh, I think sometimes the people that write this stuff, they don't really understand how real estate agents think in our business. So I think it's going to be great when I can get in there and actually start building this stuff myself. But I'm excited about that. Lead generation landing page software that allows you to offer a lead magnet. So this can be built into your CRM. It's in our CRM. A lot of CRMs have them. So if you have it, then you don't have to do any integration and you just automatically start a campaign when somebody signs up and start communicating. Voice messaging, texting and tracking. So that's key. Who's texting and calling you? Can you set up audio messages? And can you basically lead capture with it too? You know, if you can have someone call into a number that's assigned to you that's local, that's a lead capture way to do it. So you can put those numbers on your, on your sign writers and that kind of stuff. So key, but be careful. And I'm going to warn the EXP agents, if you don't do this, if you don't have your own number, that number is going to the office and you need to have your own number. I'm just warning you, okay? Because it's going to end up in the office and some, who knows where that lead's going to end up at if you're putting your number on the sign writers. Just FYI, watch out. A built-in tool that can automatically um, add leads to the system when somebody calls or texts you. So that's kind of built into that. Other tools to help you identify your hot business based on integrations with your emails, texts, or um, website login, search and save activity, just depends what other kind of things you have. 